Uh, Bismillahir Rahman Rahim Islam guys I hope you're doing well and so today I'm going to I'm going to start and other we already in the last video we have done a um, agile development but in here is agile practice so we are going to read about the agile practice today and this lecture gonna be um, very cited for me because I'll, I would love to read about the agile practice and here is <coughs> First of all, friends, I hope you will enjoy the last lecture. Um, you can watch uh, in my on my channel uh, the last lecture I have um, <coughs> uploaded of the of this series of this course. So let's start the agile practices. So first of all, though, I would love to uh, announce. I would love to tell the name of the agile uh, practices. Uh, writer here Henrik Henny. Henrik is his name but Henny is I think is a nickname he just added so many uh, of us have lived through the nightmare of the project with no practice to guide it the lack of the customers are disappointed by the sleeping schedules growing budgets and poor quality and developers are disheartened by the working ever longer hours to produce ever poorer software so here he is explaining that the um, a quality is really matter whenever someone pay you to um, complete uh, a project to develop um, software or these kind of stuff uh, if he's offering you should work uh, with all loyalty and with hard work to um, provide them a quality so friends um, in the practice you should work well uh, because uh, the practice will um, make you more better to uh, improve and anything like that okay so in the next paragraph we are going to read uh, the once we have experienced such a fiasco we become after it of repeating the experience our fears motivate us to create a process that constraint our activities and demands certain outputs uh, of um, artifacts we draw these constraint and outputs from past experience and choosing them that appeared to work well in the previous project okay I have you getting the words okay here in the next line is here our hope is that they will look they will they will work again and take away our fears uh, 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 in this next lines they are explaining that uh, whenever you, you will provide uh, your quality products quality uh, um, digital things or uh, anything you are providing them to getting paid um, if you first time you providing them a good quality things then they will uh, be a, a fear free okay <clears throat> so however uh, the project let me uh, zoom something however what is uh, one more thing the um, this file is attached and provided the link in the description you can download it however projects are not so simple that a few constraints and artifacts can reliably prevent errors as error continue to be made we dis diagnose those errors and put it in place even more constraint and artifacts in order to pre prevent the word is uh, divided in the two parts prevent those are in the future okay after many projects we may find ourselves overloaded with a huge cumbersome cumbersome process that greatly Im impedes impairs our ability to get anything done okay big conversion uh, process can create the very uh, problems that it, it is designed to prevent it, it after many projects after many projects we may find ourselves overloaded with a huge comer some I'm repeating this line again or process that greatly impairs our ability to get anything done okay a big cumbersome process can create a very problem that it is designed to prevent 
it can slow the team to the ex extent that schedule slipped and budgets blot blot okay it can reduce responsiveness of the team of the point where they from where they were where, where they uh, in the next line is there, the next slide okay they are always creating the wrong product unfortunately this leads many teams to believe that they don't have enough process so it uh, in so in a kind of runway process the inflation they make their process ever larger a runway process inflection is a good description of the state of affairs in the many softwares companies are circa 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 2018 to their world are still many teams teams operating without a process the adoption of the very large heavy large heavy with process is rapidly growing especially in the large corporation okay though here is the uh, complete practice stage first stage and the and I, I I just read all the topics which are important while practicing the agile practice agile which is very important to um, because whenever you do the do your good provide a better results in the practice then you can when you will be a professional in creating something developing something designing something that would be um, a great one okay so practice is a very important thing as well you know the example the practice makes a perfect okay men's or women that doesn't matter okay so today we just read about uh, practice so in the in this lecture it, it was a very small lecture I just explained and wrote read everything and you can uh, also take a screenshot of this okay simple it's very simple you can take a screenshot of this whole page and you can read it properly okay and in the next lecture we will explain the agile alliances okay and this is a very good thing the small videos and small tutorial will um, I think teach you properly small thing to practice again and again that would be better for you and um, as well you know the last video was on the agile development and this one was agile practice and here the huge um, slide and we will read and learn about this okay because practice is more important so I hope guys you like this video um, and you done the subscription subscribe to our channel to watch the next video next next lecture and uh, kindly uh, share your opinions in the comment section Allah Hafiz